We are very happy to announce that it has been five years that Nefriplus launched its first center in Banjarai Hills, Hyderabad in 2009. So in this five years, we have uh, set up 35 centers, we have inked agreements, 50 agreements across the country. We are present in 13 states serving 3,500 patients. So now on the fifth year anniversary, we are launching five different new dialysis centers again across the country. We are inking public-private partnerships uh, in these, there are two uh, PPP centers and there are three private centers as well. We are also launching something called as Dialysis Olympiad, where we are inviting dialysis patients from the and all the cities across the country to come and participate in the Dialysis Olympiad, wherein there will be a marathon, one kilometer marathon, there will be swimming uh, you know, competitions, there will be tennis competitions, there will be battle, badminton. The reason why we are uh, asking people to participate in these games is that we want to communicate that dialysis does not mean end of life. People on dialysis can live life as normally as I do, provided they take good quality and uh, frequent dialysis. So we are trying to communicate to everyone, to the government, to the patients, to the doctors, that dialysis patients are capable of much more. There is no necessity uh, for anyone to think and get scared that dialysis is end of life. Indian average is just about 12 months to 14 months, dialysis average. But if you look at the developed countries, they live for 15 years, 20 years, 30 years. That is a change in the mindset that we want to bring. Earlier we have done it at city level, now we want to do it at the pan-India level. And we have, uh, you know, uh, launching the peritoneal dialysis service uh, on uh, occasion of the fifth year anniversary as well. This dialysis can be done at home as well. Till now we have been doing dialysis services in our centre. But with this uh, you know, anniversary, we are launching something called as peritoneal dialysis services as well. Patients can travel, patients can go on vacation, they can get dialysis in their home uh, itself and Nephroplus will be taking care of the services. Yeah, so uh, our, belief, our belief is that uh, you know, in the future, uh, India will follow uh, the world, like what has happened in the world, right? So if you look at US or UK or Australia, anywhere, entire Europe, no tertiary care hospital actually does dialysis. Dialysis is outsourced or taken care of by a private focus player like us. Right? That's the same thing that is going to happen in India as well. We have seen that Max Group of Hospitals, which is the biggest chain in North India, that has already outsourced all its dialysis services to Nephroplus. So similarly, uh, many hospitals will start outsourcing and they'll come to us. For example, Jahangir Hospital, Apollo Jahangir Hospital in Pune has outsourced its dialysis to us. Fortis Hospital in Ubli has outsourced its dialysis to us. So many, many large dialysis hospi I mean, hospitals are outsourcing its services to us and that is going to be the future. That is the way it will be done.